welcome to Bachelor of the Week. I'm your host, Sabrina Vidal. And I'm Jamie DeLine. And today we, we will be interviewing Joseph Osuna. Welcome, Joey. Thanks for being guys? here. Thank you for having me. Good. So, Joey's a bachelor here at SUNY Cortland. Um, he's a senior business economics major from Rockland County. So let's get to know you a little better, shall we? Sure. Do you have any interests? Yeah, um, I definitely love music. And uh, anything sports related is a big part of my life. I love basketball, football, baseball. I love going to the events, things like that. It's great. What kind of music are you into? Um, depends on the mood I'm in, but for the most part, I like I like my rap, my hip hop, R and B. Um, but I'm open minded. I'm Do you have a specific genre that you listen to the most? Uh, artist that's your favorite? Um, artist that's my favorite. Right now, I'm listening to a lot of August Alcine. A couple Drake tracks here and there. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> Do you like Drake? I'm not into that kind of music. I'm a <laughs> country girl. <laughs> so you're not yeah. a bachelor, clearly. <laughs> so are you involved on campus? Um, I try to be when I can be. A lot of the rec activities, I, I like to get along, get together with my friends, and we do the basketball, baseball, football, whatever there is on campus. We'll try and run around and do stay active. Okay. Good. That's, that's good that you're involved. So once you graduate college, because you're a senior, what do you plan on doing? Like, What's your dream job? My dream job, I don't know if I have a dream job per se, but I definitely, I don't know, I was promised money after I graduated, so <laughs> <laughs> these four years, hopefully, hopefully they pay off. I just want to be somewhere where, where I'm happy and I'm able to travel. I don't want to be stationary for too long. I want to see the world and experience new cultures. Mm, you seem like you have a lot of plans, so let's get more on a personal level. Right. Are you a relationship or single kind of man? Um, at this point in time, I am single, but if a relationship were to happen, it wouldn't be the worst thing. I'd probably stay more focused that way. Is there like a certain quality you like in a girl? Or yeah, definitely someone that has to be confident. I don't like someone that um, feels like they're in constant competition with someone else. If right. I'm with you, you should be okay with that and not have to worry if I have female friends or anything like right, that. Right, because you don't want the jealousy to like interfere with your relationship. Yeah, I totally get that. <laughs> Are you the jealous type? Mm. All right, I'm not going to lie. Uh, there it goes. <laughs> no, True. I'm, I'm not extremely jealous, but every once in a while. But I check myself. I, you know, <laughs> if I'm okay with if I if I can do it, then she should be able to do it. So. Okay, so as far as features, I guess, for a girl, do you like personality, physical features? Definitely. What attracts I mean, you? Of course, something physical has to be there. You don't just go up to ugly people and wonder if they have a good personality. Ugly. Right, like personality like keeps yeah. and like physical aspects like attract. Of course, yeah. But uh yeah, pretty face can only get you so far. So a good head on your shoulders is definitely definitely a must. Do you have a preference between like blondes, brunettes, redheads? Like what would you prefer? Brunettes, seeing as how I'm sitting next to two that <laughs> good answer. <laughs> good answer. That works out. Do you have a thing for girls with nice nice eyes, being that you have nice eyes? Um <laughs> yeah, I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't hurt anything. I, yeah, I would say one of the first things you notice in a person is their eyes, that and their smile. Okay, nice teeth are just something you gotta, <laughs> you gotta have. Okay, so what's your typical first date? Typical first date, nothing, nothing too crazy. Probably, probably dinner and a movie. That way you can get to know the person first. I feel like once you're on a more personal level, you'll be able to pick out events that both of you guys are like to do. You don't want to do something too crazy on the first day and scare someone away, so <laughs> keep have it safe. You, have you ever had a really bad first date with someone? Can really you tell us about it? Um, really bad first date. My friend, he, he was with a girl, and she had a friend, so I was the take one for the team guy that, that <laughs> day. And uh, he, he described her, and she sounded like someone I could be around, but uh, it wasn't exactly how he, d he described it, um, <laughs> so the night ended pretty quick for me, and I got out of there, but I tried at least, A for effort. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever tried to kiss someone on the first date? Mm. You got to feel things out first, like towards the end of the night, you, you usually get the vibe if it's going in that direction or not. If it's not, then I don't suggest you try it, because you will look like a fool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you don't want to scare anyone off. No, not at all. So, 
do you have like long term goals like for relationships? Like, do you want to get married eventually in the future? Or Kids. Do you just want to be a bachelor for the rest of your no, life? No, <laughs> definitely. That's not. That's not something I aspire to be. Not at all. Um, I do love kids, so hopefully one day I can have a few of my own. But um, it's not something I'm rushing into. I definitely want to do a lot of things before, because that's that's a long commitment. Once you have kids, you you got to be shackled down and. <laughs> I right. got a lot of things I want to do before that. Well, good for you. You so sound like you have like your life pretty well put together, and oh. your future goals sound great. So. Thank you. Girls like that, definitely. Don't you? Don't you agree? Agree. <laughs> <laughs> well, Joey, it was so nice to get to know you. Don't you agree, Jamie? Yes. Thanks for being here. No problem. Thank you for having me. So, thank you for tuning in. I'm Sabrina, and I'm Jamie, and we'll see you next week. <laughs>